Welcome to today's Cardio Bounce Workout. We are going to get heart healthy today, bouncing on our rebounder. So optional equipment, you can have a small deflated ball and you can have a pair of light hand weights. I usually have a stool right by my side so I'm not getting on and off my rebounder. This is a heart healthy cardiovascular workout. So let's get sweaty and let's go. Don't worry, we're gonna get into it. But grab your ball, put it between your legs. Just stand here, We've gotta make sure we get proper form. Shoulders set back, down and away from your ears. You're gonna feel the chest open, the hips open, hip, knee, ankle alignment. Don't roll onto the outside of your foot. Don't roll onto the inside of your foot. And start pressing into the mat. Health bounce, this wakes up our body. So I just wanted to very slowly wake up our body before we get into this workout. We've had a very busy week with our body, getting some heart health in, cardiovascular exercises, bone health with our weightlifting. And now it's just time to just wake up our lymphatic system, wake up that digestive system, just move that lymph through our body, detoxify, just one song, one song. Let's give that to us. Ah, deep breath in. Breathe into the deepest part of the lungs. And exhale. Pressing down into the mat. Again, a beautiful inhale. And a beautiful exhale. We're gonna do that just one more time. A beautiful, Big inhalation, really get that oxygen in your body. And a beautiful exhalation. Focus on your workout today. Set the shoulders back down and away from your ears. Yes, I'm going through the fundamentals and yes, I go through it every time. So we don't want to roll on the outside of our foot. Don't roll too far on the inside of your foot. Don't roll too far forward on your toes. Don't roll too far back on your heels. Correct posture and alignment. Slight bend in the knee. Now the focus and the work is not on the lifting and the jumping, but on the pressing down into the mat. So equally between that right and left leg, press down, nice and equal. So you don't wanna be pressing down more on that left or more on that right. Nice equality between that right and left side. Can you do that for me? Woo, let's start rolling those shoulders back while we're doing that beautiful health bounce. I firmly believe whenever we get on the rebounder, we need to slowly wake up our body. Our first song, our warm up, should always be the health bounce. I do not see very many instructors, rebounding instructors doing this. They get on and they go right into heavy bouncing. We gotta warm up our connective tissue. We wanna say, hello lymphatic system. Hello digestive system. Hello body. Let's wake up. Let's get that blood flowing. Let's be kind to our body. Beautiful. Now I'd lift up your heels. Now let's begin to lift up our heels. We're starting to warm up a little bit more and through those ankles. So you're just keeping the toes in the mat. You're lifting the heels. You're not squeezing the ball. You're merely holding it between your inner thighs. What does this do? It really helps uh, maintain correct form, postural alignment. People say, Angie, why do I need this ball between my legs? Feel it. You have a natural pelvic floor engagement. So it helps track in proper alignment your hips, knees, ankles, and toes. So that's why we're doing it. So our heels are coming off. 
Now, if you're feeling warm, start to take your feet off. A little small bounce. Again, we're not pressing or squeezing that ball. We're just merely holding it. It gives a natural activation of that pelvic floor. Now, if you feel you have to tinkle your panties, you can always do the health bounce and you do not have to take your feet off the rebounder mat surface. Woo! So you guys should be nice and warm right here. Breathe it through. All right, are you ready? Let's go ahead. Let's take that ball off. We will not use it anymore. Grab your ones, one or two pound egg weights, and let's start bouncing out and in. Feel good cardio right here. One minute. This is your feel good, steady state cardio. Now, egg weights are a beautiful addition to any rebounding workout. These are egg weights right here. If you want to know more about them, please go in the description box below and you will see them and you can click the link and you can buy a pair. They're beautiful for, they are great for rebounding, power walking, cardio boxing and cardio kickboxing classes. They really add an element whew, of push to your workout right here. Steady state cardio, 60 seconds each exercise. Woo, how we doing? All right, we're gonna turn that into a ski. Oh, one of my bungees just came off my rebounder, but we're okay. So I am using a Bellicon today, and I am using medium bungees. Now, you can stay totally, you guys keep going. Lower intensity, right here. Lower intensity. Remember, you don't have to jump. You can just do it. Lower intensity, right here. This is steady state cardio bounce. You should be able to hold a conversation. Yeah? Beautiful, feel good, steady state, heart healthy cardio right here. All right, let's go back into those beautiful jacks. Now, keep going. I'm gonna show you that lower modification right here right here now remember you can just use your rebounder mat and pretend you're on the floor you don't have to add a big bounce you can not use your arms as another option and hold on to your stability bar how we doing team so we are a fit team. You're my partner in today's workout. Yeah? Loving it. Just breathe it through. You should be able to hold a conversation. No huffing and puffing. Let's go back to that ski. You are so blessed. You get to move your body. You get to bounce. Wow, is that not? amazing you get to do this workout for your heart you get to stay heart healthy wow Woo, that just gives me chills because that is such a blessing remember you are not whoo, landing on the outside of your foot or the inside of your foot nice and even you want to visualize your legs are on that railroad track. Yeah? You got it. Use those arms. We want a higher caloric output 
Anytime you use those arms and legs at the same time, man, you abandon it. Ooh, last time jacks. Arms up and down on this one. Pressing down into the mat. That is where the work is. It's not in the jump up. Whew. It is in the bounce down, the deceleration down. Come on, use those arms. Those egg weights are really packing a punch. They're kicking up my heart rate just a little more. Still in that steady state cardio. Be sure you're pressing down into the mat. Now, if you want to activate the glutes and the hamstrings, focus on pressing down through your heel and up. So press down into the mat with your heels. You're gonna feel that butt hamstring activation. Last ski, keep the arms. Pressing down, legs are on a railroad track. Soft bend in the knees, hips, knees, toes, pointing forward. How we doing? We're getting ready for our first heart health push. You must challenge your body in order to change your body. You are bouncing because I am putting my spring on. You're bouncing in the center. My uh, spring came off or my bungee and I didn't want that. Okay, first one, TikTok, first Tabata. Now, if you don't like that, you know how to modify. Always keep one foot on the mat. Five, Beautiful modification four, right here. Three, two, one. Oh, let's go quick. Woo. We are challenging our cardiovascular system to grow right here. And this cardio Tabata. This is why we're doing it. We're challenging our heart because we can, Three, because we know we're two, strong. One, rest. We're gonna do that again. Cycle one, complete. Come in the center as your active recovery. Beautiful heart challenge here. I know you're up to it. Look Prepare at me, team. And you can do it. Work. Whew. Come on. Three, two, one. Always come Rest. in the center and bounce. Cycle two. Next one, complete. high runners. You're pressing down into the mat. Lower intensity. You're going Prepare at a slower pace. And work. From the side. Get the knees up. Shoulders set back. Down and away from your ears. You are not rounding forward. You are pressing into the mat. Three, two, one. Bounce Rest. in the center. Cycle three. Again, you complete. pick how hard or how light you go. Your call. You ready, partner? Prepare. Thumbs up. Let's go. And work. Are you challenging your heart to grow so we can change it and get greater cardiovascular endurance? Yeah? That's why we're here. Three, two, four. One. Rest. Next one. Cycle four. You can complete. low jack. Woo! You don't like that? Prepare. Out, out, and in, in. Work. Again, listen to your body at all times. Always modify. You don't have to Three, do what I'm doing. Two, one, rest. A great Cycle option. Five, complete. Out, out, in, in. Beautiful option. Out, out, in, in. Prepare and work. Just challenge your body in this track. Three, two, one. All right, next Rest. one. Cycle We're gonna six. kick the heels complete. up. Lower intensity, heel taps, 
on your Prepare mat. Prepare and right here. work. Higher intensity. Oh. Kick it off. Your call, uh, where you go with it. Go as quick or as slow as you want. Three, two, one. Woo. Rest. Cycle seven, Woo. complete. Breathe it through. We're gonna do that one more time. We get 30 seconds recovery. Prepare and work. Get a water break after this, if you want. Come on, push it, push it. Three, two, one. Bounce and in the center. Rest to bottom. Thirty complete. seconds recovery. Recover for thirty seconds. Come on, team, let's go. Whoo! All right, are you giving me a beautiful thumbs up? Yeah, are you giving me the best high five ever? Look at me, you are strong, you are fit. You are powerful. Yeah! Own it, man, own it! Get that flame under your butt. Say, I am strong! I am powerful! You are blessed! Okay, we're going back into steady state cardio. I'm gonna grab my two pound egg weights. Optional, people! Bounce in the center. I'm ready to, woo, take my steady state cardio up. Just a little bit. Give me heels right to left. Here we go, one minute. I got those two pound egg weights. Steady state cardio. Heart health. Burning that body fat. You want to burn that body fat on your weight loss journey. You should be able to hold the conversation. No huffing, no puffing. Steady state cardio. Now keep going. If I wanted to lower the intensity, look at this. So your call, your workout, you know how to modify. I expect you to take it. This workout is from beginners through advanced. If you're advanced, wear a weighted vest. Grab those egg weights. Push and press down into that mat. Even more. Yeah, baby. Oh, feel it. Woo! You got that beautiful smile on your face. Feel those endorphins running through your body. Oh, yeah. Hey! Oh, man, I got goosebumps. I feel so good. Now we're going to go out to the side and then ski. Jack and ski, putting those two moves together that I taught you before. Jack and ski. Whoa. One minute each exercise. You all know why. We're on different rebounders. My bounce will not look like your bounce. So you're gonna jack and you're gonna ski. Your intensity. Are you pressing down into the mat? One jack, one right, and left ski in the center. Give me heels again. Hooey. Keeping the moves really basic, really simple. Now my heels, are really digging in to that reformer mat surface. Really grabbing that rope, pulling it down, getting that back activation right here. I'm using those two pound egg weights. Come on. Hey. Pressing down nice and equal between that right and left heel. Steady state cardio. No huffing and puffing. If you're huffing and puffing, you are more than steady state cardio. Slow it down. You're here to burn body fat. When you take it up into the aerobic zone, the anaerobic zone, you're burning simple sugar. All right, let's go back into the jack and ski. 
Jack and ski. Jack and ski. Push it, push it. Woo! How are we doing? Let's do a check-in. No huffing and puffing, right? No, because you're burning body fat in this track. If you're huffing and puffing, you're starting to go in that anaerobic. Woo! Fuel system. Burning the simple sugar. Simple carbs you had for breakfast. If you ate breakfast. We want to burn that body fat for fuel. Ooh, really feeling that my arms and my legs with these beautiful two pound of egg weights they're really kicking up Woo, the cardio for me last time with the heels last time cross the arms up and down come on heels come in front let's keep the move simple today but let's keep them challenging by using those arms, by using those egg weights. Pull down, grab a rope, pull down. You do not have to have egg weights. You don't need anything. This whole entire workout today can be done with your body and your rebounder, nothing more. So don't ever think you need all this other equipment. Okay, put the egg weights up, Tabata. Bounce in the center, let's go. Bounce in the center. We're gonna start with tuck jumps. You can tuck jump, holding on to your stability. You can tuck jump, or you can do knees. Five, four, your three, call. Two, one. Let's go. Work. Let's challenge our heart. We're getting even stronger with our heart health by challenging. Try to drive the knees up to belly button height. Press down nice and firm between that right and left foot. Three. With your mat. Two. One. Bounce. Yes. Cycle one complete. Side to side bounce. Active recovery. You're moving. Moving. Pick whichever style you want. Prepare and let's go. Work. Press down nice and equal between that right and left foot. Don't roll out. And don't roll on the inside of your foot. Shoulder set back, down and away from your ears. Three, two, one. Pull. Rest. Next Cycle one. Two complete. Switch, bounce, switch, bounce. Option, tap, prepare, and tap. Work. So, switch, bounce. Okay, look, you can tap tap while you hold on to the bar just like that okay three two one rest cycle three complete Woo. we're gonna do that one more time pick whatever you want guys Prepare you work out and work Half turn. Three, two, one. Bounce center. Rest. Cycle okay. four complete. Watch me. Next one. Tap the toe on the inside. Just like this. Prepare. Or heel taps. Work. I showed you the modification. Bump jumps. Heels touch. Three, two, one. Again. Next. Cycle five complete. Heel touches on the inside. Woo. Prepare and let's work. go. Yeah, you're strong. Three, two, Woo. 
one. Yeah. Rest. Cycle six, complete. Okay, last two. Whatever your favorite exercise is. Your call, your choice. Prepare and work. Whatever your favorite exercise is. Push it. I love these. This is my favorite exercise. Woo! Three, two, one. We're gonna Rest. do that. Cycle seven. One more time. Complete. And then we're going into standing core, and we're done with our heart health Prepare part of class. And work. Woo! Three, two, one. Doesn't and it feel rest. so? Bottom complete. Woo! Just Recover bounce side to side. Seconds. Thirty seconds. Small swig of water. We're gonna use one weight. No weight is required. You can hold on to a wall. You can hold on to your stability ball. Bar. We're gonna be going into standing core, and we're done with this heart healthy bounce workout did you challenge your cardiovascular system you bet check did you burn body fat by doing steady state bounce cardio check are we gonna get into that standing core check all right guys you're gonna put that right foot center we're just gonna take that left knee and the right elbow take that right elbow behind Core time. Now you can hold onto the wall. You can do this on the floor. If you don't have a stability bar, do this on the floor. You can hold onto a sturdy chair. Eight more, here we go. One, two, three. How about four more, looking good. Four. Oh. All right. Let's take the knees forward and lift. Actually, why don't you take the arm down as that leg comes up, down. Really hitting some internal and external obliques. You're gonna do eight more. We're gonna take a break and we're gonna switch sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're gonna get a little break, shake it off. I just gotta move this so my foot doesn't, uh... okay, you're gonna put that weight again. No weights required. Don't put that stress on yourself that you gotta have everything I have. That left elbow comes behind that right butt cheek. 16, here we go. One. Oh yeah, baby. Standing core. So elbow behind the butt cheek, working internal, external obliques. Eight more, and then we straighten the leg. One, two, three, four. Oh yeah, five, six, seven. Now we're gonna straighten the leg, arm comes down. Ooh. Two, fill it in your side right here. Three. Whew. Hip, knees, toes pointing forward. You got eight more and I'm gonna give you a little break and then we're gonna lose the weight. After this, we're gonna do standing core and we're gonna challenge our balance. Again, do it all on the floor. Always hold on to the stability bar if you need to. Let's take that weight away. I'm gonna let you shake it off for a minute. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna grab a rope and pull. Now you're on an unsteady surface, so you can grab a rope and pull with one hand, not two. Let's grab the rope and pull it down. Pull, now the back, pull. So you're gonna grab a rope and pull, working major balance, working that core. Get that knee higher, then the belly button. Now lean it back if you can. Natural core engagement. Really visualize you're grabbing a rope from the ceiling.
and you're pulling it down in between your knees. Grab and pull. Grab and pull. Feel that natural core activation. Yeah. Feel your balance. Woo! I know. We're on an unstable surface right here. That's a beauty working all those stabilizing muscles. Let's do one more set of the grab and pulls. Lift. Lift. So pull that rope down. Pull the rope down. Four more. Four. Woo! Yeah, a little <laughs> challenge. Two more. Okay. Knees together. Circle. So your insides of your knees are super glued. Now interlace your fingers. Place the backs of your fingers on your forehead. Super glue. Elbows to the back. Reverse the circle here. Reverse. Yeah, I said knees, inner thighs super glued. Major balance challenge. Nice and even. You're not rolling on the outside of your foot. Woo! In a minute, we're gonna have our feet hip width apart. Reverse your circle. Yeah, much nicer. Right here. Elbows back and open. Full circles. Soft bend in your knees. Really watch your foot placement. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna reverse the circle. Reverse. Soft bend in your knees. Right here. Beautiful standing core. Your core is just not your front part. It's your front side and back. Now let's go wide on our mat. Reverse the circle. So, whoo, four and three and two and one. If you're done with class, look in the description box. Go to the cool down and stretch right now. Thank you for coming. It's an insult okay. to who you I'm are gonna going to be. I'm going to use my bar. You can use your mat. I'm going to take the leg up. That was the last time I said someone was better. Feel your soul right now. Listen to it's these words. About time I focused on me. Beautiful stretch on the outside. Back of the leg. I run my own race. I'm not looking over my shoulder. Other leg. You can be like this. I won't do it no more. No, no. No more looking at other people thinking I'm not enough. You are so enough. From now I'll be strong. I'll be strong. You are strong. I am comfortable with who I am. Grab that right foot. I can live my life by someone's expectations. When I try to be someone else, I hold back my own greatness. I can't feel that I'm not enough. I'm better than yesterday. From now I'm not looking over the other leg. Absolutely. I am unique. I can only be me. Look over your left shoulder. I won't do it no more. I won't do it no more. Look over your right no shoulder. Looking at other people thinking I'm not enough. All right, come off. From now I'll be strong. One leg on. Leg off. Arms up.
side. Hold on to your frame. Beautiful inner thigh stretch here. One more song to stretch through. Beautiful, beautiful workout today. Take the time to work on mobility and flexibility. And let's go to that other side. Stretch that other side. Let's get nice and equal. Yeah, 